Imagine a race between two titans of the sky. One, a jet that has soared high but fell hard after two deadly crashes. The other, a bold newcomer from China ready to shake up the game. Boeing 737 MAX is clawing back from the brink, while China's COMAX C919, promising to break the monopoly of Western giants, faces delays and certification hurdles. The stakes couldn't be higher. With these two aircraft head-to-head, -head, one wonders, can the C919 ever truly threaten the dominance of the 737 MAX and Airbus A320? Or will it remain in their shadow? Let's flash back to May 5, 2007, Kenya Airways Flight 507 a Boeing 737-800 carrying 108 passengers and six crew members tragically vanished from radar and crashed, leaving no survivors. The shock of this disaster echoed around the world, shaking confidence in even the most established aircraft. It was a harsh reminder that no company, no matter its reputation, was immune to catastrophe. In the wake of this tragedy, China saw an opportunity to rethink its approach to aviation. While Boeing's 737 series continued to soar alongside Airbus, China quietly began plotting a new course. Determined to reduce its reliance on foreign manufacturers and motivated by the need for safer, more reliable alternatives, China launched the C919 project in 2008. This ambitious effort aimed to break the Boeing Airbus duopoly by introducing a narrow-body jet that could stand shoulder-to-shoulder -shoulder with the 737 MAX and A320. But the C919 has faced a series of delays, pushing its commercial debut to 2023, far later than initially anticipated. One of the most significant hurdles has been its dependence on Western components, such as engines and avionics, casting doubts over its long-term independence, especially with increasing geopolitical tensions and trade barriers. Meanwhile, Boeing 737 MAX, despite its own crisis following two tragic crashes in 2019, has managed to claw its way back. With its service return, the 737 MAX remains in high demand, drawing on its long-standing reputation and reliability to retain its dominant position in the aviation market. Now, as China's C919 emerges to challenge Boeing's reign, will China's bold vision succeed in reshaping the skies, or will Boeing's 737 legacy continue to hold the edge? In just a minute, we'll reveal a surprising reason why the COMAX C919 might actually have a hidden advantage over Boeing 737 MAX, something that could change the future of aviation. But first, how would you like to watch our videos ad-free for just $2 a month? Or get access to exclusive content for $10 a month? For $17, you can pitch topics and get your name in the credits. Join our premium community at www.patreon.com slash the impossible build. And if you're just here for something free, grab our U.S. military billion dollar blunders video at the impossible build.org slash billion dollar blunders. Both links are in the description below. The Boeing 737 MAX and the COMAC 919 are powered by CFM International's LEAP engines, although each aircraft uses a slightly different variant. The Boeing 737 MAX is equipped with the LEAP 1B engine, while the COMAC C919 uses the LEAP 1C. These engines are renowned for their fuel efficiency, reduced emissions, and superior performance compared to previous generation engines. With up to 15% greater fuel efficiency, these engines allow airlines to reduce operational costs and enhance environmental sustainability. The LEAP 1B engine on the Boeing 737 MAX generates thrust of up to 28,000 pounds, while the LEAP 1C on the COMAX C919 offers a slightly higher thrust output of 31,000 pounds. 
Both engines benefit from advanced materials like ceramic matrix composites, which allow them to operate at higher temperatures, resulting in improved fuel efficiency. The use of 3D printed components also reduces the weight of the engines, further contributing to the aircraft's overall efficiency. In terms of dimensions, the Boeing 737 MAX and the COMAX C919 exhibit similarities but also showcase distinct design choices. The Boeing 737 MAX comes in several models, such as the MAX 7, MAX 8, MAX 9, and MAX 10, offering varying lengths and seating capacities. The MAX 8, for example, measures 39.5 meters in length and can accommodate up to 210 passengers in a single-class configuration. Meanwhile, the COMAX C919 has a length of 38.9 meters and can carry up to 192 passengers in a single-class layout. The wingspan of both aircraft is the same at 35.8 meters. Yet the Boeing 737 MAX features split-tip winglets designed to enhance aerodynamic efficiency by reducing drag and increasing lift. In contrast, the COMAX C919 uses conventional wingtips, which, though effective, lack the aerodynamic refinement of the Boeing model. This difference in wing design plays a role in the overall performance and fuel efficiency of each aircraft. Passenger comfort is an important factor for both aircraft. The Boeing 737 MAX is outfitted with the Boeing Sky Interior, which includes sculpted sidewalls, adjustable LED lighting, and larger overhead bins. The lighting system can be adjusted to create a range of moods, adding to the overall passenger experience. The larger overhead bins also allow passengers to stow carry-on luggage more conveniently. The COMAX C919, while more conservative in design, offers a cabin experience similar to that of the Airbus A320, focusing on functionality and comfort for shorter to medium-range flights. Though it lacks the advanced features of the Boeing Sky Interior, the COMAX C919 provides sufficient space and comfort for its passengers, reflecting its aim to balance basic passenger needs with competitive pricing. One of the significant differences between these two aircraft lies in their material composition. The Boeing 737 MAX incorporates a higher percentage of composite materials into its structure, including the tail cone and winglets. These materials help reduce the overall weight of the aircraft, improving fuel efficiency and enhancing its aerodynamics. In contrast, the C919 relies more on traditional metal alloys, with only about 12% of the aircraft composed of composites, primarily in the winglets, empennage, and control surfaces. Although the C919's use of composites is relatively minimal compared to other modern aircraft, such as the Airbus A350 or Boeing 787, it still represents a significant technological step forward for the aircraft's developers. Both the C919 and the 737 MAX are designed with cutting-edge aerodynamics to boost performance. The Boeing 737 MAX's winglets reduce drag and improve fuel efficiency by 1.5%, while the COMAX C919, despite its more basic aerodynamic features, still benefits from modern design principles. When comparing performance, the Boeing 737 MAX has a range of 6,750 kilometers, making it well-suited for longer routes within the single-aisle market. This extended range is crucial for airlines operating long-haul flights and seeking an aircraft that offers both efficiency and performance across great distances. The COMAX C919, by comparison, has a maximum range of 4,075 kilometers, sufficient for short to medium-haul routes but limited in flexibility when compared to the Boeing 737 MAX. Despite this range limitation, the C919 remains a strong contender for regional airlines, particularly in China and Asia, where shorter flights dominate the market. Fuel efficiency is another area where the Boeing 737 MAX outperforms the COMAX C919. With Leap 1B engines, advanced aerodynamics, and lightweight materials, the 737 MAX delivers up to 14% better fuel efficiency than earlier models. 
Although the Comac C919 is also equipped with fuel-efficient LEAP 1C engines, its overall fuel consumption is not as competitive due to its reliance on more traditional materials and less advanced aerodynamic designs. The cockpit design and avionics systems of both aircraft reflect a focus on modernization and enhancing pilot efficiency. The Boeing 737 MAX features a common display system consisting of six flat panel LCD screens that improve situational awareness and provide real-time data to pilots for smoother and safer operations. The Comac C919's cockpit similarly incorporates modern avionics, largely sourced from international suppliers. Both aircraft employ full fly-by-wire controls, replacing traditional mechanical systems with electronic ones to provide more precise control over flight surfaces. This technology improves safety and efficiency, aligning the C919 more closely to its Western counterparts. Both the Boeing 737 MAX and Comac C919 remain key players in the narrow-body market. The Boeing 737 MAX stands out for its advanced fuel efficiency, extended range, and use of cutting-edge materials, making it a strong option for airlines operating longer routes. On the other hand, the Comac C919 represents a significant milestone for China's aviation industry, offering a competitive and cost-effective option for airlines focused on regional travel. While the C919 may not match the technological advancements of its Western competitors, it demonstrates China's glowing presence in the aviation sector and its potential to challenge established industry leaders. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, subscribe, and turn on notifications for more exciting content.